What's up guys? Welcome back to another setup video. Today we are doing a one piece devil fruit grip tape design. I always like to have fun and create a cool unique design that just makes the board feel personal to me and just look, looks cool to look down at while I skateboard. So today we are skating the remorse deck. This is from the local homie Spencer. He has a brand out here in Las Vegas and I decided to rep it. And if someday I decide to make my own boards, I can definitely reach out to him. See how I can get plugged in making my own designs and stuff. So shout outs to the homie. And then we're just skating some independent stage 11s. I broke my ventures in the last video. So now I've been skating these and I've been liking these lately. And then we got Spitfire Formula 4s with the red bearings. And uh, yeah, that's what we got going on for the setup. Yeah, I'm excited. So let's put it together. First things first, tear off the clear plastic. I like the gray stain. I feel like that's a really nice touch. Not all skateboards come with a gray stain, so I just, I like that I got one that was this cool of a color. And the remorse deck, dude. This thing feels really nice, dude. I like how mellow the shape is. I'm super excited to skate this thing. So we have just this gum gum fruit grip tape, but I kind of wanted to take it to the next level. I thought if I just applied this the way it is, that it'd be just a little bit boring. So I wanted to cut out a little design. So I got some scissors and I think I'm just gonna cut out the gum gum fruit, but also just make little cuts into like right here and like right here and then kind of just make a little line between the gum gum fruit and the grip tape i feel like i don't know maybe i just have to show you guys and hopefully it'll turn out good i might mess it up but i don't know i'm just gonna try to get a little creative with it see what i could do i don't know all right let's start by cutting the grip tape there's no going back now This is sick. Forgot which piece is which now. Like that? Yeah, like that. And like that. Yeah, yeah, it's coming together. You see the vision? Yeah. Okay. Something like that. What I think I'll do is stick one side first right here, this bottom piece probably, and then stick the middle one and then stick the top one. I don't know how well it's gonna turn out, but we shall try and just see how it goes. I guess my main goal is to just make sure that the grip tape covers the board and I don't leave any like spots like this or like this would be kind of lame. So just to keep it on there, I feel like. So let's just start with like this and this. I have to also make sure that this side is gonna cover too though. And ba-doom, covers. First piece is laid down, and so far it's looking good. Hopefully I don't mess things up yet, but uh, right now it's looking good. Now we're gonna stick on the gum gum fruit. Let's do it. Now this one, hopefully I don't ruin it. No, 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 not yet. Okay, here it goes. Let's try again. All right, nice. We got two pieces on now. So far, it looks so good. Now we should have to stick this piece on. This piece didn't come out perfectly. There's a little bit of wrinkles just because the shape didn't go exactly how I wanted it, but it's okay. I think I could get over that, but so far, looking good. I think I'll keep the line skinny up here, and then as it gets to the bottom, it gets bigger, probably some like, I don't know. We're just gonna mess with it. We're just gonna see what we can do, and uh, yeah. <laughs> bro, no! Oh my gosh, bro, my brain. It went completely blank and it put down the grip tape instead of the blank piece. I don't know what the heck I was thinking right now. Actually, I wasn't thinking at all and that's why this happened. <laughs> Let's try to just worry about this section first. 
Oh my god. Actually? Oh yeah, we did it for sure. All right, for sure. We did it. It don't look the best, but I think it does its job. I think that this looks as good as it gets. Just like a little cutout, like slightly, ever so slightly, there's a line. It's not perfect and that's what gives it character and I, I kind of really like that, so. I like the way it's stuck on here. All right, sickness. Sticking it on there is probably the hardest part, just getting it all lined up and looking as perfect as I can be. I like that this grip design wasn't really meant to be like perfect or like really on point and that I could kind of have a little bit of fun with it and just kind of do it imperfectly and just give it character. So I thought that was really cool. Now we're just gonna sand down the edges, cut it like normal and put on the trucks and wheels and we got a brand new skate deck, so let's do it. Trusty T-Tool. Last thing before I cut it is I'm just going to peel up the edges a little bit. Peeling up the edges will just make it so much easier to cut along this line right here. So just go around the edges and just peel it up a little bit before you start cutting. And that's, that's what you do. All right. All right, now time for the best part, which is cutting the grip tape off. This part is always super satisfying. I always get a fresh blade. You can get like a pack of these for like pretty cheap at the store. So just always use a fresh blade when you do this. Peel up the grip on the sides and it should be easy peasy. So let's just do it. All right, so far so good. You just gotta take your time with it, you know? Don't rush this process. If you want it to look nice, then just spend a little extra time doing it nicely, you know? And that's all it is. So, I'm just gonna take my time here. I'm just gonna cut. And there we have it. It looks beautiful so far. I don't think my edges were super perfect, but it's all good. I don't really care. I'm gonna sand it down and shred it up anyway. But as far as the grip tape design goes, I'm pretty gassed with how well it came out. Um, I wasn't sure how I was gonna like space the uh, the gum gum fruit from the grip tape, but it actually came out pretty sick. So I'm hyped. Let's sand it and let's skate it. Heck yeah, so far it looks hecka good. I'm super happy with how this is turning out. And now it's time to just poke some holes and get those trucks in there. And I am ready to skate this thing, dude. Let's do it. Make these holes nice and big so that the screws don't stick out while I'm skating the board. This happens to me sometimes for whatever reason. Time to see if I have all the bolts, all the hardware. I do, I do in fact have all the hardware. Now let's pop them in the board. I always like to put my gold bolts right here on this corner. I don't know why, it just helps me for whatever reason. That's my gold bolt corner, as I like to call it. The gold bolt corner. <laughs> Same thing on the other side. Start with that gold bolt. The gold bolt corner. 
<laughs> just take all these. I'm just gonna take these babies and it's on there now. Same thing with the other side. Just grab your truck and then, and just like that, we got our trucks on. What do you guys think? The new setup. I think it looks pretty good so far. All right, board is set up. I think it looks pretty sick. I'm not gonna lie, I think I did the best that I could with making it a more interesting design rather than it just being plain black grip tape with this painted on there. I kind of like the, uh, the little lines that I put in there, so super dope. Last thing is kickflip test. Can we do a kickflip first try on the board? I guess we'll see. Today we got on the Gear 5 Luffy's. I was sitting down, so they're a little dusty, but these were brand new when I brought them out today. This is my second pair, so I have another pair of these that I won't ruin, and these will be my skate pairs. The purple aces are super fire, and then the little Puma swoosh thingy, I always think looks super sick. I actually think it looks dope with them being a little dirty because it kind of just adds character. But anyways, we got first try kickflip on this, bro. Can we do it? I don't know. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to. New board, new shoes, this combo might not, it might not be it, but we're gonna try. Let's try, first try kickflip. This is real. Ooh, 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 ooh. If I try to do it on this ground, it's all uneven. I wanna land it, you know? This ground looks decently flat. Let's do it right here. First try kickflip. Oh, wow, sickness. Well, that's it for the board setup. I think I'm gonna go to the skate park and just do a little test, nothing too crazy, but so far I'm really happy. And uh, yeah, 